In mathematics, a cardinal function is a function that returns cardinal numbers. Cardinal functions in set theory. The most frequently used cardinal function is a function which assigns to a set a its cardinality, denoted by a. Aleph numbers and Beth numbers can both be seen as cardinal functions defined on ordinal numbers. Cardinal arithmetic operations are examples of functions from cardinal numbers to cardinal numbers. Cardinal characteristics of a ideal I of subsets of X are the additivity of I is the smallest number of sets from I whose union is not in I anymore. As any ideal is closed under finite unions, this number is always at least, if I is a sigma ideal, then the covering number of I is the smallest number of sets from I whose union is all of X. As X itself is not in I, we must have ad cov. The uniformity number of I is the size of the smallest set not in I. Assuming I contains all singletons, ad non. The cofinality of I is the cofinality of the partial order. It is easy to see that we must have non cough and cough cough. In the case that is an ideal closely related to the structure of the rails, such as the ideal of Lebesgue null sets or the ideal of Mega sets, these cardinal invariants are referred to as cardinal characteristics of the continuum. For a preordered set the bounding number and dominating number is defined as in PCF theory the cardinal function is used. Cardinal functions in topology Cardinal functions are widely used in topology as a tool for describing various topological properties. Below are some examples. Perhaps the simplest cardinal invariants of a topological space X are its cardinality and the cardinality of its topology, denoted respectively by X and O. The weight W of a topological space X is the cardinality of the smallest base for X. When W equals the space X is said to be second countable. The weight of a space X is the cardinality of the smallest base for X. The character of a topological space X at a point X is the cardinality of the smallest local base for X. The character of space X is when the space X is said to be first countable. The density D of a space X is the cardinality of the smallest dense subset of X. When the space X is said to be separable, the Lindelof number L of a space X is the smallest infinite cardinality such that every open cover has a subcover of cardinality no more than L. When the space X is said to be a Lindelof space, the cellularity or Suslin number of a space X is is a family of mutually disjoint non-empty open subsets of the hereditary cellularity is the least upper bound of cellularities of its subsets, or with the subspace topology is discrete. The tightness T of a topological space X at a point is the smallest cardinal number such that, whenever for some subset Y of X, there exists a subset Z of Y, with Z, such that, Symbolically, the tightness of a space X is, when T e equals the space X is said to be countably generated or countably tight. The augmented tightness of a space X is the smallest regular cardinal such that for any, there is a subset Z of Y with cardinality less than, such that, basic inequalities C D W O 2 X W cardinal functions in Boolean algebras. Cardinal functions are often used in the study of Boolean algebras. We can mention, for example, the following functions. Cellularity of a Boolean algebra is the supremum of the cardinalities of anti-chain sin. Length of a Boolean algebra is, is a chain depth of a Boolean algebra is, is a well-ordered subset. Incomparability of a Boolean algebra is, such that, pseudo-weight of a Boolean algebra is, such that cardinal functions in algebra. Examples of cardinal functions in algebra are index of a subgroup H of G is the number of cosets, dimension of a vector space V over a field K is the cardinality of any Hamel basis of V. More generally, for a free module M over a ring R we define rank as the cardinality of any basis of this module. For a linear subspace W of a vector space V we define co-dimension of W. 
For any algebraic structure it is possible to consider the minimal cardinality of generators of the structure. For algebraic extensions algebraic degree and separable degree are often employed. For non-algebraic field extensions transcendence degree is likewise used.